Hello and welcome to Railroad Productions. I'm Gracie Hammond. And I'm Katherine Lindgren. After a long planning and building process, the Newton branch of the YMCA is finally open for business. For more on this, we send it over to Caleb Bass. The Newton YMCA opened November 10th, 2016. It is located on 701 East Wheat Ridge Drive. Well, my name is uh, Tara Thomas and I'm serving as the branch director here at the Newton YMCA. I've actually been with the YMCA for over 14 years. I spent some time at the Nebraska Association as well as out in Colorado and now I'm in Kansas. A membership for the Y is $18 a month for youth to the age of 17 and $37 a month for adults. A membership to the Y includes free access to their facilities and classes. So we are the first YMCA out of the nine YMCAs that did pre-sales with the charter membership. So we are the first Y that um, started selling memberships back in May. Uh, we sold over 750 memberships before the YMCA was even open. So we were ahead of projections because of that, and it has just blown up this last week. It has been so busy. We've only been open for four days, but a lot of people have come in and joined. So yeah, we're excited about where we are. The Y has many events planned for the next year. So in January, we are going to be doing intro to dance, cheer, tumbling, and martial arts. So a lot of people have joined the Y and they're like, I want to be in a program. And so we've been telling people, well, starting in January, we'll have programs available. So that would be my next big event. Students are excited to get involved with the activities within the YMCA. I know a lot of students have been taking advantage of the facility. It looks like the YMCA will be great for the community. Having a tough time figuring out what to buy this holiday season? Evan and Gracie are here to help you. Don't guess their size. I can't feel my arms. Always put meaning of the gift over value of the gift. Don't break your bank. Don't be afraid to buy them gift cards. Shop according to their style. Get them something they will use. Don't get them Christmas stuff for Christmas. Several students were selected for the KMEA South Central District Honors. Here's Aiden Rolf with more on this. Students are chosen by blind audition and numerical scoring. About three weeks in the school year. Out of 800 auditions, 220 are chosen for tone quality, rhythmic, and pitch accuracy. Um, shout, glory, and a third one that I can't remember. For participants, these honor groups allow students the chance to collaborate with like-minded peers, but also give them a boost in post-secondary music education. Uh, now that I got accepted, I go to like a special day where we practice the songs more and then perform the songs. And depending on my original score, I might get into the next like honor choir and then so on. Out of 800 auditions, 220 are chosen for tone quality, rhythmic, and pitch accuracy.
That's a huge honor. Congratulations to those students. For our final segment, we'll take you to Logan and Aaron for a Christmas cooking special. I'm Logan and this is Aaron and this is our Christmas cooking corner. We're going to be showing you how to make some butter beer from Harry Potter. First thing you're going to want to do is empty an entire 2 liter of cream soda into the mixing bowl, like so. And there you have it. The next thing you'll want to do is take two tablespoons of butter extract. Then what you're going to need to do is put in two teaspoons of rum extract. That's it for the actual drink part of it. Next, we'll be showing you how to make the cream topping. Now that you've set your drink off to the side, for the cream, you want to start with one 7 ounce container of marshmallow cream. Next thing you'll need is exactly one cup of heavy whipping cream. Last, you'll need one more teaspoon of rum extract. The final step for the cream is to mix it up until it's all smooth and fluffy. When it's done, this is what it should look like. Now that we have both parts, take a cup and fill it with your desired amount. After that, you can take some of the cream, put it on top, and here is the final product. That looks great. I'll have to try that recipe over break. Well, that's it for this edition of Wrangler Productions. I'm Gracie Hammond. And I'm Catherine Lincoln. Thanks for watching and happy holidays.